Tea Lovers, I'm Sarah with Steep Tea City of Angels and I was about to prepare my daily matcha and I'm trying a little something different today that I wanted to share with you guys. So at my local Sprouts, I promise I won't always talk about Sprouts because um, I, I love it, but um, I found this awesome uh, lactose free kefir and it's a grade A low fat pasteurized cultured milk. This one is green apple kale with hints of lemon and ginger and it's organic so I thought this this was really interesting because I love kefir cheese um, so this was very exciting um, for me to find and it's 120 calories per serving and it's about 17 grams of sugar per serving and it has about 7 grams of protein. So if that uh, is important to you, um, you know, the, the things that I'm mentioning, then you might want to, if you have a Sprouts or a, like a health food store near you, check and see if they have this, this awesome um, brand of kefir. So what I'm going to do, I also have um, some Isogenics. Um, I just bought this and I really, really love it because um, a lot of times I'm, I'm just like on the go, 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 and I don't really make time to um, make prepare a healthy meal so uh, in between uh, as a meal replacement sometimes I will have my uh, protein shake my isogenics I'm sorry yeah I <laughs> thought I said that wrong isogenics this one is um, creamy French vanilla so I'm going to be tossing that in to my um, shake today so um, we also have this uh, perfect matcha shaker. Check with your local consultant because lately it's been um, in and out of stock. But if you have like a regular shaker, you could use that also. So, and I'm also going to be using with the green apple, kale, kefir, and uh, vanilla. I'm going to be mixing uh, with some pineapple, my favorite, my pineapple matcha. So, all I'm going to do is take about a cup of kefir. Oh, I forgot, I have to shake it up first. So sh shake well, so let me shake it up. Okay, and then I'm gonna pour about a cup into my shaker. I mean, it's, you can use one or two scoops. I only use one scoop because I find, uh, for me, because I, I, I usually pair it up with like a piece of fruit. So, sorry if the, the table is shaking a little bunch too. So, and then I'm just going to take my matcha and I have this little um, matcha scoop. And I'm going to use about a teaspoon. using a shaker by the way you don't want to just start going you know because um, when you open the top it's gonna <laughs> explode so I'll, I like to give it a little swirl first so, so that's just a fun <laughs> little tip because the first time I did it I shook 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 and then it that I had matcha and uh, protein powder everywhere so just shake it like circular first get it nice and um, mixed up and then do your little Shakey, shakey, shake, <laughs> like that. So this is a, a good little workout. <laughs> okay, and then once it's all mixed up, you're good to go with your um, meal replacement matcha shake. So um, this has been Sarah Vega reminding you to have fun with your tea and uh, have a wonderful day.